Well, we're at the greenhouse and I thought you guys might really enjoy seeing these fabulous flowers and these fabulous kids. Good morning. Aren't they wonderful? We are wonderful. They are hard working kids, I'm telling you. That is true. That is true. What an entry <clears throat> with all the baskets. Isn't that fun? Here we go. Well, we're going to go inside and see. I'm telling you, they got lots of, lots of stuff here and little explanations as to But they are. Your short pants on. Woo! I knew you'd have some pants on. You look nice. <laughs> hey, Jim. Ah, don't spray me. <laughs> I'm just taking a picture of those short pants. Yeah. <laughs> you look good, Larry. I don't That's expect it all the time. Okay, he, I won't. He told me, he told me he has to work too much. Now I told him he should just limp once in a while so he could get out of it. <laughs> Well, Larry just had a hip replacement a few months ago. He's doing really good. Now, if you like flowers and plants, I'll tell you, this is an amazing, an amazing place. They've got water plants and from water plants right there to cactus right there. They've got everything you can imagine. How fun. A soil machine. So they put can put blocks or sacks of soil in there and it actually puts water into the mix. I don't, you never know what, what you've shot and what you haven't shot. There's so much in here. There's a lot. There's not nearly as much as there was. So they've been selling for a couple months now, and I'll tell you what, they have... One month, no. Oh, one month? It will be one month. Tomorrow will be one month. Tomorrow will be one month. But we have had a record year, by far. And uh, I tell you, people come in here and they they kind of fight over these flowers. Oh yeah, sometimes. <laughs> sometimes it gets a little crazy in gonna, here. Gonna have to have a bouncer. Uh huh. It's a true story.
look at all these beautiful, beautiful roses. And these, these roses smell so good too. These baskets here are huge and before long these all these will be they plant flowers in so that they hang down so before long they'll be hanging down all over here and all these they still have a lot of roses in here last year they were all they were sold out of all the roses except the ones that had already been spoken for which were in this cage last year people ordered them the year before. See, this shows that this is already paid for. So it won't be sold. I guess it already is sold. That's what I should say. And these little flowers that looks like a baby's breath almost like you get in a... Snow princess and they're so pretty but look at what they do. It's like oh, dandruff. They... They do I like dandruff. They do snow. That's what it's like. They're snowing. Oh, these flowers are beautiful. They really are. And these folks, they know all about them. They tell you exactly how to take care of them. So that's why they have customers that come back for 30 years. Just keep coming. Black ones, is, isn't that interesting? Now this is just one of the greenhouses. They have uh, four greenhouses here, I believe. James, when he's uh, James sits right here at this thing all day long sometimes while they're making, mixing this soil. You can see it's got a little moisture in it. See how it kind of, yeah. So it comes out of there ready to put in the pot so that those plants stay very healthy and excited. We want these plants looking excited when people come in here. Okay, now this room here, if you see, they have automatic waterers on everything, but this room here has a few flowers, but it's primarily vegetables. So it has pepper plants, tomato plants, squash, melons. Oh, 
Oh, they even have the giant pumpkins. Eggplant. White pumpkins. Cucumbers. Oh boy. This should make you want to have a garden looking at this stuff. And look, when you get it, it's already it's already well on its way. That makes you have an early garden. And above every group of plants, they have a description. Pretty cool. So it's just been open a month and people are coming in and saying, you've already sold out of my favorite thing. But you know, you just, people come to buy it. You have to sell it to them or you should. <laughs> Be wise to, I think. I think it would be wise. That's what the business is all about. Uh -huh. Got one of everything? Woo! One of everything would not fit in my bus. <laughs> These are all the herbs. It's very nice to have plants in your house though. Makes it feel very homey to me. And those look like cannons, I think. Is just looking at the leaf, I don't know for sure. Or flags, I think. Uh, canna. And these little potted herb gardens, they have a bunch of different kinds of herbs in, in there. Cool. It's amazing. And all of these plants have are individually watered. You can see the little the little watering system goes down inside there and they have adjustable tips on them. You can just twist that little tip and it will uh, you can determine the amount of water that goes in. Have fans everywhere to keep the air moving. Have big fans in the end down there. And the floors are a special material so that the water can go right on through. So that they don't get flooded or have mold growing inside here. My! When we uh, 
when we had a house we planted lots of stuff we had a couple nice gardens and uh, so we really enjoyed coming to the nurseries and buying buying plants that were already growing well in good shape and it's just not any time at all until you can have uh, food to eat when you plant these vegetables look how big these tomatoes are you know they're just the plants are are huge here so doesn't take long to start reaping your harvest not just inside the greenhouses they have lots of plants outside and as it gets warmer and warmer they have to water these very often as a matter of fact by the end of the season they'll be watering everything they have four times a day that's a lot Okay, they just opened and there's already quite a few people here starting to pull up right now you can see coming in now these are all little wagons that they can fill up with uh, with flats of plants and flowers to get them out to their cars so here's a another greenhouse so there's no cash here in this one. They have to carry it back over to the other greenhouse to check out. This greenhouse is a little smaller. It just has one giant fan at the end. So here are the girls, Coco and Maisie. <laughs> Got a big backyard to play in. Hi. So they do have Hi. a lot of flowers out there. Yes. And this is what Debbie does. Yes. She's play with my boys. playing games with the boys. This is a level that Wyatt made. They're going to they're going to try to let her win since it's mother's day at least oh, no, at least once at oh they don't let you win <laughs> this one's a co-op game oh